The Shroud of Turin, one of the most underrated yet extensively studied objects by science in the world, is believed to be the burial cloth of Jesus of Nazareth. For anyone up to date with the latest scientific findings and who has meticulously examined every aspect of this cloth, it becomes clear that all the evidence points to its authenticity. However, the world often suppresses this information and the church seemingly ignores it. Well, take a bow, medieval origin theory. Your time in the spotlight is over. So much for that idea, right? Turns out the shroud is a lot older and wiser than we thought. Recent findings have thoroughly debunked the theory that it originated in the medieval era, causing major issues with the raw data and the previously assigned date. It's like a plot twist in an archaeological thriller. The latest scientific research now suggests that the shroud is approximately 2,000 years old and hails from the region between Jordan and Syria, later being brought to Jerusalem. Talk about being well-traveled. This conclusion is supported by the flax used in the cloth, which was determined to come from that area, and the pollen found on the shroud, which is native to Jerusalem. Moreover, computer models have revealed that the man's face on the shroud is a perfect representation of a Nazarene Semitic face. Regardless of one's personal beliefs about Jesus Christ, whether you consider him a great teacher and moral figure, or the Christ, son of the living God and God incarnate, the scientific evidence strongly suggests that this is indeed his burial cloth. The man depicted on the shroud was crucified, and somehow through an inexplicable means, an image of his face and body was imprinted on the cloth.